Four reasons to be bullish on crypto. Next on your four minute crypto news. Today's show is from a post by Elsa Sakian at Bitcoinist and brought to you by Token Talks. Token Talks highlights some of the best emerging projects in crypto and blockchain and features interviews from experts and entrepreneurs in the space. It's a great place to keep up on everything happening with decentralization, ICOs, and the future of digital currency. Find the Token Talks podcast at wing.vc slash podcast. Brian Kelly stated his opinion on Bitcoin's recent surge on CNBC's Fast Money. He said that there's a really good chance that the December lows we saw in the $3,000 range were probably the lows for this cycle, and that there is a Bitcoin resurgence. He then gave four reasons for his statement. Reason number one, a strong fundamental tailwind. One reason Kelly believes Bitcoin resurgence is the real deal is that Bitcoin hasn't been improving on the fundamental front, particularly in regards to network activity. He explained there's a couple of things that are going on. The active addresses are up 26% from the January lows and transaction levels are back to 2017 levels. So there's a lot of network activity. Reason number two, institutional interest is at an all-time high. He then explained that if you look at who's buying Bitcoin, you see people like Fidelity still rolling out their institutional platform. And last week, they saw record volume on the CME Bitcoin futures. So you're starting to see institutional investors come in with a good fundamental tailwind. Reason number three, Bitcoin will surpass all-time highs. If the bottom is truly in, the next question is how high does Bitcoin go from here? According to Kelly, Bitcoin will easily surpass previous all-time highs during this market cycle. Reason number four, the top altcoins are here to stay. According to Kelly, Bitcoin won't be the only crypto that benefits from the next bull run. The top altcoins have proven themselves as viable contenders after surviving the crypto winner. He noted that we had that insane ICO craze, and there's a lot of junk out there, and a lot of those have gone to zero. He thinks that the top 10 or 20 in market cap are here to stay and will be a big part of the ecosystem. So do you personally think that Bitcoin price will surpass all-time highs? Do you think we've hit the, the bottom? Let me know your thoughts in the comments and remember to subscribe at 4minutecrypto.com slash subscribe for a new episode every weekday. And don't forget to take a look at our sponsor, the Token Talks podcast at wing.vc slash podcast. I'm Gary Leland and thanks for joining me on 4 Minute Crypto. This is a CryptoCousins.com production.